Now to a deadly boat accident that happened just off the coast of Florida. A woman is dead and several more were hurt after a boat capsized near Pompano Beach, Florida. The group was on its way back from a Thanksgiving diving trip and Bazi Kanani has the story. Witnesses say the wave came out of nowhere. It was windy, there were waves rolling in. The force apparently so intense, water went over the 45-foot catamaran, tossing the 21 divers and two crew members on board into the ocean. Chaos. People just in the water and stuff, it's like unbelievable. And rolling the massive boat upside down. Wave caught it from behind and it flipped as he was coming in, in the harbor. Investigators say one woman was killed after she was trapped beneath the capsized boat. Other passengers, many with injuries, managed to climb out of the water and onto the overturned hull. We kept hearing back and forth, you know, just trying to get a head count on everybody, and uh, you know, for, they were missing one. As beachgoers called 911, nearby boaters raced toward the accident, pulling people onto wave runners and into rescue boats. Captain Bob Casey was among the first to reach the scene. Your adrenaline kind of kicks in and all you want to do is just get people on board as quickly as possible. I just came up to them and just started pulling them out one at a time. Late Thursday, investigators questioned survivors. This morning, they say it does not appear the boat was over its capacity, but they are still trying to figure out how a single wave could have caused this massive glass bottom boat to end up like this. The woman who was killed, 54-year-old Nina Poppelsdorf, was visiting from New Mexico with her nephew. All other passengers are home recovering this morning. And Josh and Elizabeth, investigators say that considering the force of that wave mm -hmm. and the damage it did to the boat, it's surprising there weren't more serious injuries. Wow. All right. Thank you so much, Bossy. Thank you, Bossy.